G'day, I'm Mark from Self Sufficient Me and this video is about how I stopped my dam or small dam large pond from leaking water out through the dam wall and through the base. I used a product called Water Save. I don't know why they called it Water Save. I probably would have called it Stop Dam Leak or Stop Pond Leak. But essentially it's a granulated product that turns into a bit of a slime once it mixes with water and then it absorbs into the dam wall and floor and penetrates and mixes with the soil to make an impenetrable barrier so that water can't go through. It's been nearly a month now and the product is still working as it, as it did right at the beginning, right from day one when it actually stopped the leak within 24 hours and I've been totally impressed. Along with that, the uh, company and the product on the pack said that it shouldn't affect or it doesn't affect livestock or animals and I can say that now that my ducks and chickens are happily playing in and around the dam, none of them have had any problems or shown any ill health. Now I'm no dam expert at all, in fact I'm probably one of the worst dam builders ever. I have no experience in damming, so I got a guy with a backhoe and for 150 bucks I got him to dig a big hole and I thought well that'll do for a start and let's just see how it goes. What happened was I'd get good rains, the dam would fill up and then over about several weeks, three or four weeks, it would go down by about a third and then in about a month or so it would be less than half full. And then over time it would just be a, a foot deep of slush. And of course that wasn't good enough and I knew it wasn't getting lost through evaporation because I could see it seeping through the back of the wall. Now what could I do to fix this? So I, I went to Google and I thought let's see if there's any easy way to fix it. And there was a lot of talk about digging the dam out, getting in some special clay soil, making, making a, a special clay backing and all that for the, for the walls, thousands of dollars of earth moving equipment, thousands of dollars of materials and I just wasn't prepared to pay that. So I was looking for a cheaper and easier solution and I came across this powdered gel stuff that was on sale on the internet. Here it is here, it comes in 10 kilogram bucket but you can get them in, in 5 and 2.5 kilograms and, and larger and it's called Water Save. Now you can get a a seepage type granule mix or you can get a plug granule mix. The plug stuff is for bigger holes in dam walls and the seepage is a bit like mine where you've got smaller holes but mainly the water just seeps through the wall or at the bottom of the wall and then runs out. So I got the seepage stuff and it's made by Polymer Innovations. All you simply do is use a hundred grams of this stuff per meter square. That's the overall generic way to use it. But I really concentrated my powder around the back of my dam wall because that's where I knew the leak was coming out of. But I did sprinkle it all over the surface but I put a bit extra around the back where I knew that leak was. It's supposed to take between two days and 10 days to bind with the soil, sink to the bottom and really work. But I've actually seen a difference in 24 hours. The only thing is that you need to make sure that the dam isn't accessed by any of your livestock or, or poultry whilst this stuff has been sprinkled around and it needs to be given time to sink down and attach itself and not be disturbed. Now, I was really sceptical but I was a little bit desperate because I didn't want to spend a whole heap of money and I thought well this had a f quite a few good reviews from local guys around Australia saying that this is pretty good and it's worked wonders. At $270 for a 10 kilogram bucket I thought well look I'll give it a go because that's significantly cheaper than getting equipment in and more materials just for my small problem. Well I hope you enjoyed that video. I'm no uh, expert on the stuff. I'm uh, obviously 
not getting paid by the company to do this. I just know that my leaking dam was a real pain for me. My dam now is not leaking. My poultry is happy as anything. It's a real good water feature now on my property. And the best of all, the product worked as it, as it said it would. And I was a skeptic at the start, but I'm glad I went with my hunch and went with the other reviews that I read and decided to give the product a go. Please subscribe to the channel. Uh, I'll do lots of other different and interesting videos. I also write a blog and I've written a little bit about this as well on my blog, selfsufficientme.com. So go and have a look there and if you even have further questions, join our forum, selfsufficientculture.com. It's up and coming, more people are starting to join up and it's a little bit different. So go check it out. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye for now. Thank you.